This is Noor Mohammed, the man who should have been working for Greater Manchester Police, interpreting tapes that were seized in a terror raid. Instead, another man, Mian Ahmed Yan, used Mr Mohammed's identity card to carry out the work. It's alleged that Mr Mohammed gave his card to Yan, who isn't a qualified interpreter. The bogus translator did the work here at Longsight Police Station, translating audio tapes from the Afghan dialect of Pashtun into English. The tapes had been seized by police when they raided a house in March, a raid that wasn't publicised. Then in April, there were a series of high-profile terror raids in Cheatham Hill. After those, the real interpreter, Mr Mohammed, turned up, and that's when a senior detective realised this wasn't the same interpreter who'd worked for them before, even though he had the same official card. It turned out the first man had been a fake. In a statement, Greater Manchester Police said the work that this individual performed in relation to Northwest Counterterrorism Unit investigations has been reviewed. There is nothing to indicate that any ongoing criminal investigations have been or will be compromised as a result of this. They also insisted that he had no access to suspects and wasn't involved in interviews. Mian Ahmed Yan is now thought to be in Pakistan. Meanwhile, the real official interpreter, Noor Mohammed from Bradford, faces six counts of conspiracy to commit fraud. He's been bailed and is due to appear at Manchester Crown Court in December. Ben Bland, Channel M Today.